I started having dreams. About a house. A house that was built without hands. And then one day I received a letter and it became mine. Life had been breathed into a fantasy. But now it won't let me sleep until I invite others. To my esteemed friends, I have acquired an illustrious estate through the death of a distant relative who I've never met. I thought it only fitting that I invite you all to attend a dinner party on its grounds. Telegram from Mr. De La Ghetto. My ensued. It will certainly be a night to remember. However, the estate is quite peculiar and only exists in the year 1920. You're 1920? To enter its grounds, you must be dressed entirely with clothing of that era. If you are carrying anything from the modern world, the house will simply never appear for you. And not only your clothing, but your attitude must reflect the time. I have included your unique characteristics on the back of this invitation. My driver will pick you up and take you on a road that can only be driven by his mysterious time-traveling automobile. Then, almost like magic, the place will appear. My name is Shane, and you call me the Renegade. I'm Ava. My character is the journalist. My name is Glowzill, and I am the jazz singer. I'm Ollie White, and uh, I am the big game hunter. My name is Justine, and I'm the gambler. My name is Andrea, and I am kind of like a fixer. My name is Matt. I am the college professor. I'm Sierra, and I am an heiress. My name is Lily Pond, and I am a hustler. My name is Timothy De La Ghetto. I'm the mobster. I know. 1920s, we were just in 2016, then we got in this car, and then here we are. So, like, I think I know what's going on, but I'm really not sure. Do you have any mints, any gum, mints, mints, mints? I don't get to go out too much, and then when I'm coming to a party like this and it's 1920s themed, I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> this party is insane. I mean, I have been to a few YouTube parties. That's a lie, I've been to none. This is the first one I've been invited to. What do you guys think? <laughs> Welcome to my new house. Wow. This is yours? This is really your house? This is rented. I actually have inherited this house from a distant cousin twice removed. My cousins give me nothing. You all look amazing tonight in your 1920s attire. Thank you. I still it. I want to introduce you all to my wonderful staff that actually came with the house. Arthur, who is head of staff. Well, Sarah, the maid. And then there's Marvin, who's the groundskeeper. You and your staff. Dinner is almost ready, but until then, let's get to know each other a little bit more and have some drinks. I love being in the 1920s, mainly because I don't have to text people back. I don't have to worry about keeping up my Snapchat. I don't have to make any videos. This is great. This is vacation. No technology works here, which is crazy. Oh, I would love one. Thank you. I thought it would be fun to give each of my friends a persona. Since we have to dress up in the 1920s, like, why not make it even more fun by giving them a character to play up? Hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me. Oh, girl, blackjack! I'm going to deal with some cards, and we are going to gamble tonight. I'm a mobster in the 1920s. You know, that's not too far from what I already kind of represent. Coming from nothing, building my own empire, killing people, figuratively. I've just come back from Africa. Um, I've actually been hunting for the past couple of weeks or so. I'm a vegetarian, but 
I'll let it slide because his outfit's cute. I love the dark like mistress look. It's Thank gorgeous. You. Yeah, you know, I'm really into fashion. I really yeah. like to make things. I like to fix things. If he has something broken, I can fix it. Really? Yeah. Do, do you own this house? I, I need to be part of this house. I mean, it's just big. I don't have the deed yet. Uh, so you're not rich. You basically own it. No, no, no. It's, it's going to happen. Like, oh, new money. tonight, it's supposed to happen, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, and once I sign it, then it's officially yeah. mine. But like, I've been living here, so it's it's mine. Are we allowed to look around? Being the journalist, I always just want to see what's happening, and I don't think of the consequences. I'm down if you're down. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. What you gonna do, Bozell? Hit me one more time. I'll hit you with my best shots. Um, I'm the jazz singer here, sweetheart. Sorry. I know you sing pretty, but I don't do duets. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I was hoping that I was the only one that was invited by Joey, but it's fun. It's fun. I'll do whatever, as long as I get my man and my mansion. Yeah. So would you want to live here yeah. your whole life, then? Why not? Well, alone? Do you have a girlfriend? Um, no. <laughs> I guess she didn't watch my video. <laughs> <laughs> How's darts going? Ready? One, two, three. Can we, like, look around? Look around? Uh, no, I think we should just stay down here. Dinner's almost ready, so I think we should just hang out here. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. I can tell that he's lying just by looking in his eyes. There's something he doesn't want me to see. Dinner is served. Yeah. So head on into the dining room. Thank you. Name tag. Yes! Oh, the salad <laughs> looks delicious. <laughs> this is so creepy. What <laughs> just happened? Just Fell into yeah, my lap. Yeah, us, by the way. No, of course. This yeah. is so cool. Wait, where's Ava and... We're shaming. Shaming. Oh! You scared yet? Wait, he's... Wait. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait. Oh, maybe, uh... I think the dinner is ready. Where's, where's the bathroom? You should probably head downstairs. Okay, your turn. I want your job. Sitting here with the food, having fun with Joey. Oh my. I wish he'll give me some of that money. <laughs> we have a lot of girls that want money. I I'm trying to, you know, stay stay back from that. I just got the house, okay? I didn't get money. We could put it on the market. That Sarah chick is a little scary, though. That maid? It, yeah. Does she yeah, smile? She scares me. I don't she know. Has. Sarah. She needs to work on her makeup. When I become Mrs. Joey and I get in the house, she's the first one that's got to go. We should play some bets yeah, to see what I we know. think these two are, first of all. Yeah, it's been a long time. They can't be in the toilet. You can't <laughs> drop deuces that long. Part of me feels a little, like, disrespected. Like, don't go ahead and go exploring, especially when I tell you not to. So is this impressive to you, my estate? Or oh. Not? It's cute. Pretty sweet. <laughs> I just come from a really rich family. Don't really work. I was handed a lot of things my life, so yeah. Am I the only poor one here? <laughs> <laughs> so you got a bedazzled headband on. I stole it. <laughs> <laughs> I think Clozelle is so hilarious. She's taking our character to a whole new level, just bringing the energy in it. I'm so glad I invited her tonight. Oh! What is this? What do I well, no, we're not changing the subject. <laughs> do not change the subject, please. We want to know where you guys were. I was in the bathroom. Oh, For that one. Is this real food? Can we eat this? Yeah. Why are you changing the subject? I want to know where you guys were. I want to tell them so bad what happened, but I can't. I'm thinking, you know, I just need to keep this to myself and keep the group you know, calm, it's it's too early for this. As much as I love a good makeout, I was literally pooping. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay. okay. Right. What about you? I know I saw something with the maid, and I know for sure Ava saw it, but I think it's best for now to just not bring it up, but uh, eventually, I'm gonna have to tell everybody. Oh, oh hello. Oh. What is it? Oh. 
Okay, now you have to open it and read it to us. Oh, read it. Y'all jealous? What is it? What does it say on the front? <laughs> what does it say? Read it. Read it. Oh, no. She's just like, oh, 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 Shane's mouth. I mean, what is this place? Like, I I don't like it. What the hell is going on? I think I got poisoned. Oh, Jesus! He said he was poisoned. Oh, By who? <laughs> I'm in a state of shock, and I just don't know what to do. I don't know what's going on with Shane. I don't know what happened. I'm what reading the telegram. Oh, what did it, it say? It says he's been poisoned. What? what? Also, he was. He knew. He, he knew it. In 15 minutes, you'll be dead. Your lungs filled with blood. However, you know I love games. There is an antidote hidden on the first floor of the house. If you and your friends are wise enough, they'll be able to solve the clues and save you. Oh, the yeah. symbols of your cult mark the clues leading to the antidote. It all begins with your last dish of the night. May you die in horrible pain, my cursed enemy. What does she have? She's oh. got the last dish. What the? What does she have under there? Oh, no. no. Oh, gosh. I'll open it. Okay. Girl, I will fork you up. What is un underneath this? Oh, oh, my goodness. What is going on? This is crazy. And right there and then, it's like everything went mute for me. Wait, they're, they're, swinging, in, they're swinging in his mouth. No. Oh, no. I wasn't too bothered by it, you know? At first, I thought it was, like, just a, a themed cake. Oh, no. Are we not gonna call the police for this? Like... Something is not okay with this room. I like it in a perfect order, but certain things want to wander around the table instead of finding their perfect fit. Can you figure it out? Wait, what? This is what we gotta look for. This symbol, this symbol, this wait, symbol, wait. this symbol. That symbol. Why are we still here? I feel like means something. Doesn't the perfect fit, around, like, can you figure it out? Can you figure it out? Wander around the table? Come on, guys. Shane is like oh, dying. Shane. Oh, crap. Shane's like coughing up blood. I'm really concerned about him. I look over and everyone's just eating their food still, not really bothered about what's happening. But this guy is dying. I'm too stupid for this. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, oh no. Shane gonna die. Oh, no. I'm walking over towards the window and I see this weird uh, glass holder with the same symbol on the top left of it and there's only one glass on top of it. Wait, what was the symbol on there? Uh, was it this? this? Uh, oh, yes, it is. Yes, yes, it is. Yes, yes, it is. And then it's just a mad scramble. Everyone's flying around, trying to find all different glasses, pulling the wrong glass, and then eventually we found three of the right glasses, and we got another one. Oh, no, Jesus! I rebuke you, Satan! Whoa. Oh, Lord, it opened up by itself. Oh, oh, we What's in there? We need there are three keys to unlock life. This is long. I don't want to read this. <laughs> in the first floor study, one key to life is as high as a mountaintop. In the library is the second key, which lies hidden beneath the nine circles of hell described by letters and words. In the foyer is the third key to life, which can easily be found, but no one person can retrieve it without the helping hand of a friend. Uh, letters and words are in books. So my group is responsible for finding the key that's in the library. I know none of these girls have read a book in years, so this might be a problem. Is this a, is this a thing? Where's the key? Oh, oh, the oh wait, hold on, wait, 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 wait. The squares, we need to get it to the square? Before I even know it, Ollie reaches oh, straight oh, in and feels some sort of box inside, and it clicks in our minds, like, this must be the key. We have to figure out how to get this box out of this gigantic box. Okay. Hold on, hold on. So the clue that I get is one key to life is as high as a mountaintop. And Glozelle immediately points out that there's something sticking out of the mountain know. painting. I don't know now. Don't mess up these people's paint. That's someone's paint. Oh, oh, that's on. Oh! Oh, my gosh. A key! So there's two devils. Mm hmm How many souls oh has he perverted this week? Three young ones. To confound the king of devils and avoid his fiery wrath, he gives him a riddle instead of a straight answer. OK. We're YouTubers. We're not mathematicians. <laughs> Where's the mathematicians? Right, guys. I'm Asian. I got let's, this. Let's take a look. Guys, oh. we got a key. Oh. We got a key. We got one. Oh my gosh! Come on, put your hand in there. Oh, it can't fit. 
Where, where, where is it? Down. Where is it? Where is it? Where's the thing? Push it. You've got to push it all the way back here. But there's no way. Let me give it a try here. I'm trying to lend a hand, and she's a little bossy. I don't know what Matt is doing. He was just standing there, and like sometimes he was like talking about like how wrong we were. It has to be this one, then. It has to. Is there any? I got it. We need all three in order to cure him. Oh, we gotta hurry up. We gotta hurry up. There's three young ones. So, we're not doing very good, man. If you multiply their ages, you will get the number 36. It's really confusing, and the font is kind of hard to read. Wait, wait, wait. If you add all three to ages together, you will get the number of devils in the Grand Council. Yeah, tally up the ages to equal this number and then divide. I was like, I skipped this class. Oh, wait. Is this the number of devils? One, two, three, four, no, five, six, seven. It. it is, and it'll help us solve it. the riddle. And the girls are cackling in my ear. I just need a moment to figure it out. Do we have like a pen? Pen? <laughs> we don't have a pen? Yeah. We don't have time for a pen! We only have three minutes! Open please. your mouth! Who poisoned him? That's my question. You know what? It could be you because you were out with him. Yeah, you don't only want out there with him. Access to him. Speed! Peeing with poison. Push up. I had it all the it way. It can go up. Pinch and go up. Right. Pinch it, go. Quickly. I've got it all the way in the back right now. We're all getting frustrated with each other because we have no idea where this box is going. We need the key. Shane's dying. We need to work as a team. Joey, you know what? I think that you might have done it. Why do you think I did it? He has more followers, so you probably tried you to kill him. You think I want to kill Shane? Yes. yes. Why would I want to kill Shane? Because, because, because every count? Exactly. Oh, I don't get access. The person who kills someone doesn't get their YouTube account. You are the, the, the YouTube killer. The YouTube killer. You are the YouTube killer. You know what? I My love for Joe is strong, but he is trying me. He is trying our love right now. Please hurry. 90 seconds. Uh, uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. OK. Right, now it's here. Now it's here. Oh my god, you're going to do it. I get Instagram, you get his Twitter. OK, cool. I get his Facebook. Yeah, uh, Twitter's more valuable in the long run. Hurry up! Please! Uh, so. Ladies and oh. gentlemen, is that it? Oh no! Time is up. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Jane is dead. Are you serious? I'm honestly very nervous about my own life and the lives of everyone that I invited tonight. It's my responsibility. I'm the one who invited them here. What happened? They opened the I book. Know, well, he's dead now so because close. of you guys. It's not our fault. We found our key in like a few seconds. Well, he's was dead now because of one of us. It could have been you. you. Think about oh, it. No, no, no. Wait, no, no, we no, we no, got to no, figure no. out who killed him first. No, you know who killed him first? I mean, Joey. where are you? Aren't you like a, a, no, 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 a murderer? No, no. I don't kill my friends. I, I just kill people that owe money to me, all right? Oh, but I want to be okay. You know what I'm saying? What do we do with the body? OK, I don't care who killed I'm him. I'm not trying to get rid of The body? Oh, because you killed him. I honestly think it was Ava. You're she was to last to be him? seen with him. It's not me. Yeah, everyone starts like thinking that I'm involved in something sketchy, which I totally wasn't. But like, there's no way to prove that. And obviously, I was the last person with Shane before he came back. I mean, we just kind of got there. So I didn't really feel like he made any bad blood with anyone yet. No pun intended. <laughs> that was too soon. Who had a motive to kill him? But did anybody hang out with him before think, he came here? I think Joey is the person who killed him, and he's going to kill us all. He's going to kill him. I he agree. Got us all it's here. Joey. Don't be looking at me all cute no, and fine. No, you are killer. House. Right now, I'm wondering, is it worth being with Joey for all this? Is he really going to stay in this house? I can't live there. We're going to have to move somewhere. All I'm saying is we found our clue exceptionally quick with yes. the help of Joey. With the help of right. me? It was Glozell who found it. It's your house. Who was sitting next to Shane at dinner? It was Justine? Just Justine. Joey? No, I wasn't sitting next to You were to very him. close, so you're in the proximity. I was two seats away. As you were as sitting you right were next to him. to him as well. You were as close as I was. Guys, what if it's none of us and it's the maid? <laughs> Look at her. She served the head. No, uh, the cook is the one that prepared the dessert. So Joey starts searching Shane's body for clues. I'm thinking he's going to take his wallet, and I'm jealous because I want to take his wallet. Listen to this. Listen to this. If you're reading this, I have failed in my mission. My killer is not who you might think it is. It's the house itself, which is possessed of an ancient evil that has locked it in time. I came here tonight with the intention of destroying it. I am a member of a secret organization known as the Society Against Evil. 
and we've been battling this wicked force for centuries. There are four artifacts which the evil has hidden behind a series of puzzles and clues. If they can be gathered and the binding ritual performed, the evil will be locked away. However, to complete the final task to retrieve each artifact, the group must vote on two people who must undertake a dark challenge. Tragically, one of them will die. But to help you along the way, the Society Against Evil has marked the clues with their symbol. You have until sunrise to recover the artifacts before you are trapped here forever. What lies ahead will not be easy, but I'm afraid you have no other choice if you want to get back to 2016. Okay, so there's an evil spirit running around here, but we got to find like, what, four of these little things to untrap it, or we gonna be stuck in the house? Guys, I think we should leave. Follow me, All right, I have a car that can take us out of here. I think I would rather die than get stuck in 1920. I think I'm at peace with, with dying if that happens. Just a moment, wait for Glozo. Wait, wait, wait for Glozo. Come on, wait, guys, wait, let's wait, go. Wait, wait, We're not all gonna fit in one car. We can't leave yeah, Glozo in the 1920s. Come on. Guys, wait! These shoes hurt so bad.